everyone welcome and back to another um video so today we are playing oh sorry overlook bay so um let's get started so basically this is my home i just stuck with the tiny one so actually let's go in my house i'm gonna give you a tour and then i want to show you what i've gotten so far so i have been playing overlook bay since after I posted my oh okay sneak peek after I posted my late last video the Aussie eggs one and that has been a while okay it's been like a, I think I've been playing Overlook Bay for like five days or about a week or something and I've gotten a lot especially with the Halloween update so I want to show you guys my house so basically when you enter this is what you will see um you can see that. I have this little cute little things over here, this cute little rug. So basically this is my tiny kitchen, very tiny, I don't even know what to put yet. This is my little um, sleeping space, which actually we need to sleep right now, so that's really good. I have been, I have been decorating my house all day, look at my money all gone. And I have gotten these cute bookshelves over here, this cute wardrobe, which I really know what to use for we got this cute little chair which i can sit down on if i want to read some books we got a cute space over here to watch tv and all mm -hmm. we got some ceiling lights and we got my small little bathroom so i was really excited because the first time i played this um well, actually, I got the unicorn. Okay, wait, I'm gonna pause. Okay, whatever. I got the un. Okay, not universe. I, I got the unicorn on my first day on hatching my fourth diamond pet pod on that day. I mean, the chances are pretty high on getting legendaries, anyways. So, also, if I, I can mention, two days ago, I got the alicorn from a diamond pet pod from opening it like it was like the sixth diamond pet pod that day and it took me quite a while but i'm so happy because it's one of my dream pets so um like um also two days ago i bought the rainbow rider and the um, strawberry cow which i don't know guys i love strawberry cows they make me feel okay i'm sorry and i've bought it quite a few things yeah i've gotten a lot of souls because i am a say okay let's use the iron spark over here i'm actually saving up for seven thousand five hundred souls so we can get the shadow corn soon i'm just really happy and i what i've been doing really is just doing my thing i just go and you know collect some pets also if you don't know how to play this game or you never heard of this game which i think you've already heard but maybe you don't know how to play it um i can teach you so basically you log in you get some rewards and then you can go do the tutorial because actually it will give you a few gems you can go ahead and decorate your house or you can go save it you, you, uh, you basically the basic things you need is a bathtub for yourself and a bathtub for your pet i mean it will also like what you basically do is you take a bath here you can also get a sink if you want so you can if you, you can do the task where you wash your hands but i noticed that you can also use the shower to wash your hands so that's pretty good and then this is where your pet takes a bath oh my gosh like basically you just I'm pretty sure you know how to play Overlook Bay, and it's really blowing up, like, mm hmm And also, you can decorate your stuff over here, but also you need to get a bed for yourself and a bed for your pet. Those are one of, like, the basic things you need. You also need a pet bowl over here, like this. And that's it. Basically, that's all the things you need. But if you want to decorate your house, then go ahead. It is your choice. I think it's adorable. Hmm. So, 
if you kind of get lost what you do wait i'm gonna go show you guys the neighborhood i'm gonna show you guys what to do to the in the halloween update which i think you probably all know but basically this is the neighborhood and then if you need to go get some food you can go teleport to the pizza place but you have to be careful because sometimes it will say pizza place sometimes say honey's diner coffee shop you need to be very specific and careful about that Oh wow, oh, oh, oh my gosh, what is happening? Okay. So your pets would also get tasks like that, but right now, that's none of our concern. Whoa, what? what? <laughs> okay, I'll just turn off um, that chat. Oh, um, also, yeah, that's what you can do to and you probably all know the different things but what we're gonna do today is the halloween thing the halloween update so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go grab to get souls you need to go grab this you can buy more cannons but this is just the basic one so what you do is you be a ghost buster you know and like bust Goal, ghoul, ghouls. I think these are ghouls. Um, so the longer it takes, the more souls you're going to get. And yeah, I can You have to be patient. This is one of the ways you can earn souls. As you can see, that gave me 15 souls. There are also tasks, everyone. Like you can do. Oh, what the heck? Okay, there are tasks you can do. You can mine, f like first you basically mine 25 crystals, bust 10 ghouls, or trick or treat at 15 homes. So I've already mined about 47 as you can see. I can bust more ghouls to earn this. Now I can just bust ghouls all day, but I can, always sh I can also show you more. So wait, let's get started. What can you get with the souls? You teleport to the Halloween event thing and you go over here. As you can see, the shadow coins will arrive in two days. Okay, I got a task. Oh, I played for one hour. Oh my goodness. Okay, so basically this is what you will see. And there are new Halloween vehicles which are really cool i was gonna save up for this but then i, I forgot shadow coins are arriving so what you can do is actually donate here because you're actually going to get a group reward if you if we reach those <laughs> i actually really like this <laughs> So, so basically, if you see this thing, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go up the ladder. The, oh my gosh! And then you're gonna go in, and then you can get the rainbow rider, which is the one we have here. This is it. If you guys want to see it up close i mean you maybe you don't like it when you're gonna buy it you don't know if you want to buy it this is it actually i don't regret buying it they're so cute it is for 795 robux that is quite a lot but it's worth it so you can also get the hex cat for 3500 now i can buy it this one and make a shiny but i think i feel like i want to wait till shadow corns arrive i don't know how to get oh my gosh as you can see the hollows eve shadow corn is for i already have enough for the dark magic shadow corn but i want the hollows eve one um i maybe can save up for both but i never know so you can also get a halloween which you can get um, quite a few pets from. I only got two pets from it. I got two ghouls and one zombie. Actually, the the chances of getting good pets are kind of hard, but you can do it. So overall, there are sixteen Halloween pets right now. I think that includes. So um yeah. 
So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to mine. That's a really good way of getting souls. I've gotten this much souls out of um, four hours of mining, which is great because it's really hard to get the souls. So what you do basically is you go to the crazed caverns. Let me pause. Okay, we're here. So what you're going to do is get a pickaxe. So you basically get this as a starter pickaxe but i have gotten the pretty pink one and yesterday i just got the rainbow chroma pickaxe which got me five thousand souls in four hours yesterday yes i farmed that all in four hours yesterday so what you can do oh oh wow that's really lucky see it brings up the luck and it's a lot faster and you also get rewards for leveling up so at level 40 i will get 10 free wishes that's amazing now the higher the level you go it is a lot harder to level up let's do one round of mining and see what that can get us oh look she has an alicorn too that's cool so basically what we're gonna do is keep mining keep mining just if you're bored you can just grab another window and watch stranger things or whatever while mining that is amazing so i'll just keep mining and mining oh wow and see if you mine a lot you can get free wow that's a lot so basically if i mine another uh, 100 more crystals i can get 250 souls for free so let's grab this oh the one that actually gets you the most is the princess gem which is a pink heart gem i'm pretty sure and i have gotten and i have already sold most of my crystals so yeah i'm gonna keep mining and it is actually really fun and i heard this is a permanent update okay this is a permanent update you will be able to mine even when the halloween update is gone that's amazing or event i think okay see it's giving me one of more of the cooler um crystals other than the fool's gold because usually when i use my baby blue pickaxe i only get fool's gold and that's not pretty good is it of course it's not so let's keep going let's keep going okay i'm getting kind of bad ones but at least it's not the full skull it just gives you two times the luck which is pretty cool and you can buy it for five thousand gems but of course there are other pickaxes too don't worry everyone they can get better luck and maybe a little bit faster but i recommend this one because basically it's just the easiest one to use so what you're going to do is we're going to head up here up and then you're going to go inside and then as you can see this is the one that you can these are the prices that you can sell it for as you can see the princess gem is worth a lot so we can sell all this and wow that is a lot of souls and let's see as you can see this is the shop you can buy the pretty in pink pretty pink pickaxe for uh, 750 gems not souls so that's a bit easier to get you can get the magma pickaxe for 2000 gems the golden pickaxe for 3500 and the rainbow chroma pickaxe for 5000 it's a bit of um, an investment, but I'm going to tell you, it's worth it. Okay, I have been playing Overlook Bay for a long time, and it's crazy, because, but it's really fun. So, yeah. I am very excited for the Shadow Corns. And also, the last thing I want to show you guys is you actually need to go to your house. You need to go out, and then you can do the trick-or-treating pet. Now, I already got the trick-or-treating pet. As you can see, it's called the Sweet Tooth, and it is 
godly which i think is really generous and really matches me but i don't really use it often so how you can get it is you go over here and you grab this is the starter one it's only um plus zero but the one i have is plus four you can buy this at the which is you can buy this at the witch's lair which is basically the tree house we've been in so you can buy more pails and more um just more so basically it gives you candy so the original of this was 10 but i got 14 because of this bag this bag was 500 souls which i, I don't regret buying because i got the pet in less than an hour of grinding so let's actually just go to three homes because I can't do this all day. I have a lot of things to do after recording. So, oh wow, that gave me um, a bonus. So some of them give you souls instead of candy, which I think I'd rather get candy for now because that's the reason why I've been trick-or-treating. But it's still awesome because you get 25 souls. Oh, yeah, it actually has a darbell thing but i didn't put my audio on since and mine overlap my voice okay so that's it and then what you're gonna do if you've gotten some more basically i already gotten 23 that's a lot and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna feed it to this pet and then if you have enough you can unlock it so this one is what it's called it's just called god uh, uh, it's just called sweet tooth anyways thank you very much for watching this video and i'm very very excited for the shadow corns to arrive oh my gosh i'm so sorry <laughs> i'm extremely excited but thank you so much see you guys